Many Christian believers have a false security of salvation. They claim security of salvation based on single verses from the Bible. They've been taught that they only need to believe in Jesus for salvation. We read in Romans chapter 10 verse 9, If you confess with your mouth Jesus as Lord, and believe in your heart that God raised Him from the dead, you will be saved. For with a heart a person believes resulting in righteousness, and with a mouth he confesses resulting in salvation. For the scripture says, whoever believes in him will not be disappointed. That is true. But if we believe in Jesus, we must obey him and live according to his teachings and commandments. Jesus warned, as we read in Matthew 7 verse 21, not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but he who does the will of my Father who is in heaven will enter. Many will say to me on that day, Lord, Lord, did we not prophesy in your name, and in your name cast out demons, and in your name perform many miracles? And then I will declare to them, I never knew you. Depart from me. You who practice lawlessness. We have to obey Jesus and bear good fruit, or else we will not enter heaven. Many are preachers and profess to be followers of Jesus, but they are not. We will be known by our fruit. Jesus said, Beware of the false prophets who come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly are ravenous wolves. You will know them by their fruits. Grapes are not gathered from thorn bushes, nor figs from thistles, are they? So every good tree bears good fruit, but the bad tree bears bad fruit. A good tree cannot bear bad fruit, nor can a bad tree produce good fruit. Every tree that does not bear good fruit is cut down and thrown into the fire. So then, you will know them by their fruit. Many professing believers will end up in hell because their deeds are evil. The Apostle Paul also warned sinning believers in Romans 2 verse 4. Or do you think lightly of the riches of his kindness and tolerance and patience, not knowing that the kindness of God leads you to repentance? But because of your stubbornness and unrepentant heart, you are storing up wrath for yourself in the day of wrath and revelation of the righteous judgment of God, who will render to each person according to his deeds. To those who by perseverance in doing good seek for glory and honor and immortality, eternal life. But to those who are selfishly ambitious and do not obey the truth, but obey unrighteousness, wrath and indignation, there will be tribulation and distress for every soul of man who does evil, of the Jew first and also of the Greek, but glory and honor and peace to everyone who does good, to the Jew first and also to the Greek. For there is no partiality with God. Without holiness, no man shall see God. Those who disobey Jesus Christ and do not live according to His teachings will perish. The words of Jesus are clear and simple, as recorded in the Gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke and John. Jesus said to His disciples, Go into all the world and preach the gospel to all creation. He who has believed and has been baptized shall be saved, but he who disbelieved shall be condemned. Obey Jesus, repent and be baptized, live according to the words of Jesus, seek him always and he will guide you. Stay with Jesus until the end, or you will not enter heaven. You will end up in hell. 
Jesus will never leave or reject you. Nothing can pluck you out of his hand. But if you stray from Jesus, then you have left him. And you will not be worthy of entering his kingdom. Jesus warned that only those who endure with him until the end will be saved. Work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Seek Jesus, obey and follow him until the end and you will be saved. May Jesus bless you. Jesus Christ is alive and hell is real. I am here to introduce you to Jesus Christ so that you can know him and follow him and have eternal life. Subscribe to my channel to learn more about Jesus. May Jesus bless you.